For the longest time in video game history, Mario and Sonic have been competing to see which games could be better than the others, Mario games or Sonic games. But there is one Sonic game that sticks out to a lot of people if you played it on the GameCube era. Sonic Adventure 2 Battle deserves a remake. Let's discuss. How's it going everyone? My name is Asinator and I want to welcome you to the channel. The first thing I want to go over in today's video is talking about why on earth am I making a Sonic video when my channel is primarily focused on everything Mario. Well to be honest, I have no idea. But what I can tell you guys is, you know, I was talking about this in my Discord server, which obviously you guys should join. You know, we talk about anything Mario, and I shouldn't be advertising Mario on a Sonic video, but they were in a game together, Mario and Sonic at the Olympic Games. But anyways, yeah, this conversation came up in my Discord server. We were talking about remastered games, and I said, I know what game, you know, deserves a remaster. And this came up in the conversation. I asked some of my YouTube friends, and they seemed to agree, so I figured... Why not? This game is probably one of my favorites from my childhood, so let's just discuss why this game deserves a remaster. So yeah, that's pretty much why I'm making a Sonic video right here on the channel. But don't expect a lot of things other than Mario here on the channel. I just really wanted to make this video, you know, it's hard for me to make a video that doesn't, you know, you know, revolve around Mario per se. But yeah, with that out of the way, another thing I want to mention really quickly is my great YouTube friend, Wook, has started an eSports team. It's called Solar. I'm part of that as a content creator. He does, you know, for his team, Pokemon Unite, Super Smash Bros. Ultimate, and Mario Kart. So if you guys do want to be a part of that as well, go check out his channel. Go check out that Discord server. And with that all out of the way, let's actually dive in and discuss why Sonic Adventure 2 Battle needs a remaster. So the first thing I want to go over is a real quick recap of how the gameplay was. And obviously, I'm not going to go into too much depth because I'm pretty sure 90% of you guys have played this game. Obviously, if you're a huge Sonic fan you have, or if you're a Mario fan, you've probably checked this out like me in the past if you're younger or you just are really curious about video games. But in this game... You had two sides of the story. You had a good side and you had a bad side. And obviously the good side included characters such as Sonic, Tails, and Knuckles. And the evil side had Dr. Eggman, Shadow, and Rouge. And obviously they had their different sort of gameplay aspects. Sonic and Shadow were pretty much like your typical Sonic stages. Tails and Dr. Eggman were more of like just, I guess you could say, platforming type levels where you're in a robot, you know, controlling a robot, I should say, shooting down enemies, and they both had the same sort of gameplay. You had to make it to the end. And you had Knuckles and Rouge as pretty much these scavenger hunt levels, and you had to find three things throughout the levels, you know, the master emerald pieces, or in some cases, the keys where you had to open up, you know, a door to a boss fight or something like that, if I'm even remembering that correctly. But yeah, you either love these levels or you hated these levels. I feel like there's not really an in-between state when it did come to these levels. You know, let me know if you guys love these levels or you hated these levels. But yeah, those are pretty much how the characters played, you know, on each side of the story. And the last part I want to bring up in this video. And obviously, you guys can probably hear a little bit of laughter in my voice because I tried to take this tape five times without messing up. Just smiling like an idiot because of the amount of nostalgia and the amount of fun I had. But I feel like if I don't bring it up, I'm gonna get called out on it, and it's gonna be the Chao Garden. And honestly, I'm not gonna spend too much time on this, but this was pretty much a game in a game. And obviously, if you guys have played this, you know what I'm talking about. And I just felt like it was, you know, more than a game. It felt like you were living with the Chao, like you're raising your Chaos. And obviously, I don't even know if I'm saying that correctly, but let me know if I am or not. But yeah, you you had the Angel Chaos and you had the Evil Chaos. And I was just doing so much research, you know, doing the karate mode. Like, how do you beat this guy in the karate mode? And there was another race mode. I was like, how do you beat the top guy in the race mode? And I was like, you know, to my friends, I was like, how do you get... The angel, the evil Chao, and I did so much research on like my iPod, you know, back then when obviously iPods were popular back then. Now we have Samsung and Apple, and obviously I'll talk about more nostalgia in here in a minute. But yeah, this, you know, Chao game, whatever you call it, the Chao world, just brought a ton of memories. And obviously, if they were to remaster this game, they need to bring this back. Obviously, it wouldn't have the same feeling as now, because obviously we're older, we have, you know, responsibilities and stuff like that. But yeah, I just felt like this game, you know, was part of my childhood, and it grew up with me. So obviously, let me know what you guys think about the Chao world. You know, I hope it returns if they ever do decide to remaster this game. But yeah, and the last little portion I want to bring up for this video, and obviously, I didn't play a ton of it, but some of you guys 
guys must have, and obviously you guys have your own nostalgic memories with this, and you know, what's your favorite nostalgic memory? It doesn't even have to be Revolving Sonic Adventure 2, just let me know your favorite nostalgic memories. I like reading them, I like to get good laughs, but yeah, the multiplayer mode. And obviously, like I said, I didn't play a ton of this, but I know there were a few levels that stuck out. You know, there was one level where you had a race to the end, obviously I would cheat, and you know, just, I don't, like, Sonic or Shadow, whoever you can, just, you know, the speed drop all the way to the bottom and try to speed run it and make my friends, you know, laugh and, you know, just run in the other room because they're laughing too hard, they're too embarrassed. Or, there's another level where you had to do a 1v1 with, I guess you could say, Chows or something like that. It's not the karate mode, it's when the Chows are in the robots and obviously I can't do two-player because obviously I don't have a GameCube. So yeah, honestly, let me know what you guys think about the multiplayer mode. I didn't really have a lot of nostalgia for it, but obviously there were some moments in there where I was like, oh my god, this is too funny. But yeah, let's actually dive into a bigger aspect and not talking about Sonic Adventure 2 Battle anymore. It's the whole, I guess you could say, idea of, you know, old gaming compared to now. So I feel like the biggest thing, obviously when it does come to a Sonic Adventure 2 Battle Remaster, is we want it to be perfect. You know, we want it to be pretty much just how it was back then. You know, obviously that's what a remaster is. We don't want anything changed to it. But I feel like, you know, gaming back then, obviously this revolves any sort of game you play, whether it is Sonic, whether it is Mario, whether that's Fortnite, Roblox, or anything, you know, revolving the gaming industry now. I feel like that we're now all grown up and we have responsibilities. I talked about this earlier in a video. We don't really have a ton of time to sit there and enjoy the game. Obviously games now, obviously I'm going to bring up other examples from the gaming, you know, universe. You know, we talk about Call of Duty, Battlefield, Destiny, Fortnite, Roblox, even Mario, and you know, Sonic, I, I don't really know the things of Sonic. I was Sonic Frontiers is getting free updates, I think that's what I saw. But yeah, the tr big AAA titles, you know, there are other games out there that are doing remasters. And I feel like the biggest problem with the video game industry right now, and obviously I'm going to talk about remasters as well, is microtransactions. DLC and you know if it is the case of remasters the remasters you know being glitchy being buggy not being the one-to-one -one that we expect but with just up hands and visuals obviously I don't play a ton of remasters I like the newer stuff you know here on the channel like I said I love everything Mario but I just feel like this is a good talking point you know talk about one of my fan favorite video games growing up and also the current state of remaster I just felt like doing a double take here on the video for you guys you know talking about two subjects and I feel like if we were to see this game see the light of day in a 2023 or a 2024 even a later year remaster and glorious HD it just wouldn't feel the same the controls could be off the multiplayer mode could be laggy the shower guard could be missing sorry the chow garden could be missing the single player may be shorter they may have DLC to add to this game and it's just like it's it stinks like it, I don't even want to say it stinks it sucks because you know you have that mindset where you know you just are really anticipating a remaster and this doesn't go for the Sonic universe anymore it goes towards any sort of game out there that you guys are looking forward to to get a remaster it's just the world that we live in and it's just you know it sucks you know I like I said earlier in the video I just you know would love a one-to-one -one remaster of this game alone obviously there are some games that we still are currently waiting on and there are still two big titles that I feel like are getting talked about more and more honestly I'm gonna bring these up really quick because I don't care too much about one of them GTA 6 and Mario Kart 9, Mario Kart 10, you know, Mario Kart Tour's ending. So that means, you know, I guess you could say the next Mario Kart's coming out. But yeah, it's just the current state of everything right now. And obviously, I don't want to go into too much more depth. But I just feel like, you know, if we were to live in that same sort of past where gaming, you know, matters. Instead of, you know, who can pump up more money per game or who can make the most sales or, you know, who can make the most microtransactions. It's just, you know, sticks. But yeah, you know... After that whole entire rant about just everything, let me know what you guys think. Do you guys think Sonic Adventure 2 Battle deserves a remake? Or just, you know, are you guys excited for any other remakes? It doesn't have to be Sonic at this point. Are you guys excited about any other remakes out there? You know, just let me know. And obviously, yeah, that's going to do it for today's video, guys. Hopefully you guys did enjoy. Obviously, like I said, this is probably going to be the one-off Sonic video that I do make here on the channel because I primarily focus on Mario. If you guys do want to see any sort of other Mario, or I guess you could say not Mario, but Sonic videos or anything from Nintendo, 
just let me know dm me on discord or whatever the case is gonna be obviously my discord is gonna be down there in the description as well but yeah just let me know and i will do it for you guys you know if you guys want to see it but yeah like i said that's gonna do it for today's video guys if you guys want to stay subscribed for more mario content or i guess you can say anything else gaming now because you know now i'm not afraid to make a video like this so yeah hit that subscribe button if you guys do want more that out of the way i just want to say thank you guys so much this is ace here signing off stay healthy stay clean bye